Good morning from Capture Hostel New Seminet, where I've been for the last two nights and I spent a very drunken New Year's. I've had a lot of fun here, but it is a pie hostel, so I do need to leave before my liver leaves without me. I've been in Bali now for 12 nights, which is a long time, spread across three different destinations, and I've really, really enjoyed my time here. It's a lot of fun, but it is crazy busy, crazy commercial, tons of tourists, tons of expats, which is not a problem, but it takes away from the authentic backpacker feel, so it is well and truly time I move on. And today I will be heading with a very special top secret guest, to think Nusa Limburgum, which is an island nearby, but we're gonna head to the ferry port and find out what ferries are available because I think it's cheaper to book it at the ferry port than it is at the hostel. As a parting gift from Capsule Hotel New Seminet, they've given me this lovely little key ring with my name on it. Guys, allow me to introduce you to Backpacker Tampan. Backpacker Tampan here. <laughs> we met both on Instagram, Instagram and then we followed each other on YouTube and we're gonna spend a couple of days shooting, editing, filming, whatever it takes. Everything. Next up, we got a grab to the port and I will see you there. We have arrived here in Sunur where we are gonna go find to see if we can't find a boat to get us anywhere really after a 30 minute taxi and that cost us a grand total of 50,000 I was just telling backpacker tampon how much cheaper it is to get uh, taxis here than it is in the UK because that in the UK would set you back about 50 or 60 quid easily success we are definitely heading to Lembongon the ferry is actually at half 12 so we've got a little bit of time to go and get some nice breakfast. So I paid 150000 for my ferry ticket over to Lembongon. I think, how long is the journey? Maybe an hour or two? Like, no, like 30 minutes. Okay, 30 minutes. Not too far at all. And fun fact, for Indonesians it's half price. I think it's got something to do with the fact that it is their country and Westerners come here with all their money so it makes a lot of sense really. But just be prepared for that. It happens in a few other countries as well. Definitely happened a couple of times in Thailand and maybe in Vietnam as well. <laughs> Gotta get that gram, yo! <laughs> Breakfast is served. I've gone for a Mediterranean vegetable wrap and backpacker tampon has gone for an Indian chicken curry. For dessert, I've got myself an ice lolly, which is actually called a palatus. It's a uh, fresh frozen fruit and I've gone for a watermelon and lime flavor. And I can tell you that it is actually really, really good. Boat time. sunshine and blue skies, white sand, crystal clear water. It's like being back in the Philippines. I'm honestly very, very happy. So far, Bali's rainy season has been very grey, so it's really, really nice to see this kind of weather. We're gonna get ourselves a couple of little scoots so that we can explore the island and drive ourselves to our homestay. I'm told this island is like a no helmets island. Everyone here is chill and there's not too much busy roads and stuff, which I believe, but um, having no helmets still makes me a little uncomfortable. Sorry, mum. Ooh, come through pool with beach bar stools. The best. We have arrived and checked in here at Nitia Homestay. I don't know how you can call it a homestay when it's basically like a full-on resort hotel. Paying something stupid like seven pounds a night per person to stay at this glamorous place. Look at this. Did book a twin room, but they're trying to give us a doubles. So we're just seeing if we can sort that out now, but as doubles go, Pretty nice. This is coming from a guy who's only stayed pretty much exclusively in hostels for the past four months, so to have some kind of a room to myself is amazing. Conclusion is, this is our room. There's no twin rooms left, so um, this is what we're having. Didn't really get an apology or anything, but never mind. I guess maybe the booking was too late or something, I don't know. But this is what we got. I think it's time we grab some lunch, how about you? Yes. <laughs> so I'm told there's a little warung across the road. A warung. It's like a, I guess it's like a cafe. Is that how you would describe it? Yeah, a small cafe means warung. In a lot of Southeast Asian countries, they don't really cook uh, at home. They kind of just eat out all the time. So a warung. Some of the locals would go and eat and have their breakfast, lunch, and/or dinner. Mushroom and asparagus cheesy pasta for me. 
2018 diet is going well so far and talk to me about CrossFit. All right, nice lunch over at Lemongrass. Not too bad, not too bad at all. Now we are heading back out on the bikes. We're going to Devil's Tears, which is a nice viewpoint here on Nusa Lembongan Island and hopefully get some decent photos, chill out a little bit. Here we are at Devil's Tears. Basically, it served as a viewpoint for watching the waves crash against the rocks, but very stunning location. Hi, little friend. You alive or dead? Ugh. I think he might be dead, because I just poked him and uh, he didn't move. Ugh. No, he's dead. Oh shit, there's a turtle! Oh my god! For the gram! Devil's Tears was super cute. Now we're gonna head back on the bikes and follow the leader to the next spot. I'm not sure where it is. Only time will tell. Let's follow on. Next up, we are at Blue Lagoon. It's appropriately named. This is some of the bluest fucking water I've ever seen in my life. Excuse my potty mouth, but sometimes I just can't help it. When the moment calls, you know? The moments of natural beauty where non curse words just won't cut it anymore. We have come to Mahana Point for a little pit stop and a drink. Check out the scenery. There's some surfer dudes here and some jumping off points. I don't think I'm going to be doing that because they charge you to do it and I'm not that bothered about dying today. But maybe another day. Drone Envy once again. our last stop on today's vlog. Now I know you're devastated this vlog is coming towards an end but there will be another one in the next couple of days so fear not. If you did like this video please go ahead and give it a thumbs up, share, subscribe, do whatever you want to do. I will leave the link down below to Backpacker Tampons, Travel Vlogs and Instagram so be sure to check those out and I will see you again soon. Goodbye.